Hello and welcome to the world's smallest mosh pit. These wiggling green dots are cells of the microbe Euglena, invisible to the naked eye. They can be found in almost every pond, and a standard microscope is more than enough to observe them. In case you want to learn a bit more about the organism Euglena, please check out my other video linked in the right hand corner. But now, let's talk about dancing Euglena cells. Euglena has two modes of movement. It can swim using a flagellum, which is a string-like whip it uses to create thrust in water, or it can crawl and wiggle like a worm. The outer protective layer of its cell, the so-called pellicle, is equipped with filaments that act as a primitive muscle. These structures allow Euglena to contract and expand the cell as it pleases. Under the microscope, these structures resemble the swirly lines of a human fingerprint. Scientists baptize this Euglena dance as metaboli. The question is, why does Euglena require two modes of movement? Is it just coincidence? The Euglena cells in this video were of course filmed with a microscope. The Euglena cells are squeezed between two glass plates for better observation. The Euglena cells sense that they are being confined and try to escape. Water in tight spaces is behaving very differently due to capillary forces. As a microbe, swimming will definitely not yield enough thrust to escape. So Euglena switches to metaboli, to wiggle itself into freedom. What might seem to us like a joyous mosh pit dance party is in reality pure despair and the bear will to survive at all costs. This behavior raises a lot more questions than it answers. How can a unicellular microbe sense danger, act upon it and have a will to survival at all? Why and how should it be aware of its surroundings without a nervous system? Thank you so much for watching. Let's dig up some more dirt and let's stay curious.